have been told by Triumph that the first 100 miles I shouldn't I'm not going to say can't because obviously you can go above three and a half thousand RPM um, but Triumph have told me that I shouldn't go above three and a half thousand revs and he kindly altered the settings on the bike um, so when the revs get close to the three and a half thousand it'll start and change colour from the blue or the black is it blue I can't see dark blue black um, to a, an amber and then I presume it'll go to red if you if you if you're going above the three and a half thousand rpm um, once I'm over the 100 miles it's then 100 to 300 and I can go up to 5,000 RPM so here we are I'll take us up to 3 3,000 approaching 3.5 and, and you can see there it's changing colour to an amber um, and that's done through the settings uh, you put it into uh, running in mode just to help with a, with, a, with a visual on the dash to help you not get carried away obviously again the first 100 miles I suppose we have to be reasonably careful with the with the, with the tires as well scrub them in a little bit so there we are it's changing again <laughs> change gear Or something like that, he said. Fiddle, 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 fiddle. So there, there's me miles. Cruise control. Do we just set? Wrong way. Set on the bottom. Yeah. Oh. Set on the bottom. No. Well, I just activated it. There we are. So, press it once to activate cruise. Press it again to set. That is so much, so much easier than the Explorer. Um, on main, we had a silly button there that you had to depress for the activation of it, um, which your hand, your hand came off the throttle a lot better a lot better so we'll cancel that by rolling up forward on the throttle or your brake clutch big improvement big upgrade for me and then we can just alter our speed with a depress with a depress with a press of the button set 29 30 30 miles an hour 30 miles an hour so running in horrible I want to go and play here we are, I'm sitting at three and a half thousand revs ish. Trying desperately, desperately to get the first hundred miles out of the way. Now I presume because this is set in running in mode that when that changes to a hundred miles 
the orange will disappear and let me rev it up to 5000 rpm before it starts getting orange and that would be much more useful 70 80 mile <laughs> So it's like being on your test again. Running in. Is it important? Is it that important? Oh, I don't know. Do they know if you've gone over the RPM stated? They plug the software into the ECU, and then if you end up having to make some sort of warranty claim, can they check? And then say, I'm very sorry, but you didn't run it in according to the Triumph handbook. Your claim is void. 100 mile. I'll be happy when I get the 100 mile out of the way. And then we can rev it to 5,000. It won't be as bad. And then what have we got? Oh, can't see. 300 mile, I think it is. From 100 to 300 mile, 5,000 RPM. 3,500 RPM. 6th gear. 58 miles per hour. <laughs> 98 miles so what I'm hoping for is that when it clicks to 100 then this color will just go back to dark blue black whatever it may be like that I suppose and then let me rev to 5 before it changes to the orange or the amber. That's what I'm hoping for. So rather than changing to orange at three or two and a bit, three, yeah, it should let me rev up to five before, well, four and a half maybe, before changing to amber ninety nine and oh <laughs> come on in fact is it it's not changing now is it Yes, is it going to work? It's going to work. Already in sixth gear. Getting excited, you see. 99, come on. 50, yeah, because at 57, 58 miles an hour, that was already at amber. There's my 100 mile. Let's see. Yeah. This is better. So, yeah, very happy. 100 miles complete. And the bike, obviously, all of a sudden, will feel... Uh, will feel more usable. Use the cruise look.